Enter my hut and collect the evidence I found. I'm sure it will help us find him. Enter my hut and collect the evidence I found. I'm sure it will help us find him. Uh-oh. There's another one of those bug monsters here. That can't be good. in here. Did the Goliath destroy it? Or was it even here in the first place? Go see what Tick Tick Snake Tongue has to say about this. None of this is good news. You better go to Baobab and talk to Inyanga White Stripes.
Jumbo, young wizard. Your story is worrying. I do not know this tick tick snake tongue, but he sounds a coward and mischief maker. We must find out what happened to the water hole, and in turn, part the trail of your classmates. I have a plan for curing one of these fire lions. I need you to collect baobab fruit from the young baobab tree over there. Once you have the fruit, go into my hut and cook the fruit in the cauldron. Then bring it back to me. Collect baobab fruit from the young baobab tree. Then cook it in the cauldron in my hut. Bring it to me when you are done. You collect the fruit of the baobab tree. It is ripe, heavy, and smells wonderful. You place the baobab fruit in the cauldron to cook. The aroma is amazing. You take it out quickly to make sure it doesn't burn. Excellent work. You would make a great Naganga, a spiritual healer. You have made a strong Muti, traditional healing potion. Now the tricky part. We only have enough for one dose, so we must determine which is the right lion to feed it to. Queen Tanai Ghostmane is known as a friend to all the people. She is the one we must find. You will need to force some of the Fire Lion Ravagers around the waterhole to tell you where to find her. Then you will have to convince her to take the potion. She will certainly fight you. However, once you have given it to her, it will take effect at once. Talk to her and find out what you can about this curse.